what's up everybody how's it going <laughs> hello everybody hey 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 uh guess Hi. what uh this was god awful you guys should have seen us setting up today <laughs> this was god awful it's been a horrible fucking experience if, if you would do it uh earlier than a half an hour before the fucking show oh no <laughs> i want to fucking might not be so hard why why would we do that why would we fucking do that? kill myself <laughs> uh, no greg no I think Greg's used it again. <laughs> He's really hyper. He's been touching everything in the house, <laughs> including my penis. And I just that realized once. <laughs> Cam's brome. He hello to you too. Hello, 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 hello. Oh, All right. God damn it! And Boy, I just sir. realized that Greg looks like Bald Bull from uh, Mike Tyson's Punch Out. <laughs> he fucking does. <laughs> So you'll, you'll notice I'm sitting in the director chair today. We all know how well that works out usually. So that's going to be interesting. You know what's funny? No. I forgot to turn the other lights on. <laughs> you awesome. Really <laughs> fucking dark in here. Keep, keep checking. Keep talking, Jay. Keep <laughs> flowing with it. Yeah. Can yeah. you go turn them on, please? Yeah. It's, it's... You know what? It actually doesn't look bad on camera. I'm surprised. Let's see what the difference is. We'll see how much reflection comes off of Greg's head. Oh, you're funny. It's true. I look at my fucking head. Oh! Oh, turn oh him my, off. Oh my turn god. Him off. Wow. Okay. All right. We're there well. We we're, we're, business, we're back yeah. to our professionalism. We have a guest calling in here in about uh, about ten minutes or so. So that'll be interesting. Who we, is it? We have a. We, I I can't say it's a national security issue. <laughs> it's national security. I can't. I can't. I can't divulge that information until it happens. I, uh, uh, okay. I'm in charge of the sounds today. No, so I am. Be amazing. Greg, don't you fucking touch it. You piece <laughs> of shit. You're such a... That's a huge bitch! <laughs> so, <laughs> so because of our, our, our uh, extreme professionalism and uh, dedication to making this the best show possible, I forgot to buy beer today. <laughs> I have Mountain Dew, though. That was cool. So, so there will be no beer of the week. Uh, our band of the week was, uh, was called Next Bullet. They, I, I have no idea where they're from, but they are not American. <laughs> Uh, they're from Italy. Awesome. They're from Italy. They're they're actually a side project of that uh, band we played last week, Overblood. Uh, and you can uh, check out their stuff on nextbulletband.stereokiller.com. So if you like hardcore music, they're your people. Check them out. Hardcore music. Hardcore. They're from Italy, so Chelsea knows them. Um, <laughs> Merhaba. I always make fun of Chelsea because oh, she's really Italian. Did you get uh, your not girlfriend to cook for you last week? Yeah, she cooked me tacos. Right. No, yeah. Of course she did. Right. Then I ate taco. her taco. Now's the time for the rim shot. <laughs> I, I, I don't know where the... It says rim, rim shot on that's it. That's a chainsaw. <laughs> we'll just, that's what my relationship feels like with her. <laughs> it's the button that says <laughs> rim shot, you jackass. It's somewhere over here. <laughs> okay, there it is. That, that sounds like a... And uh, Trevor's already hitting on Greg. Yeah, yeah. Trevor <laughs> says, I'm going to fuck Greg. We're frozen. Good fucking job. Oh, great. OBS Studio disconnected, reconnecting. <laughs> what does that mean? Jeez. I don't know. I didn't do nothing. I did nothing. Oh, goody. OBS Studio, yeah, reconnection successful. Talking. Excellent. So does, um, that, so does that mean we're on again? I have I, no I idea. so. Um, not uh, according to my phone. Hi? Excellent. So does, um, that, so does that mean we're on again? Great. I have I, no I idea. So. <laughs> oh, um, oh my god. Not according to my phone. Oh my god. Hi. All right. Yeah. All right. We're back. You guys there? Yeah, it's back. See. You you people. Okay. Chelsea says hi. We're back. Uh, we got a disconnection somehow. Nobody pulled any cables or anything. Nobody fucked anything up. This no, time. you did though before the show. <laughs> but yeah, oh yeah, I straight up unplugged the computer. Yeah, yeah we were. Uh, it was ready. all set up. Get ready for the show in about five minutes before the show. Uh, Jay trips over the cord, unplugs everything. I'm not used I'm to sitting to in this seat. That. God damn it! Yeah, yeah, you do. It comes right back. By it's God. a seating arrangement. You're absolutely right, Chelsea. It is the seating arrangement. What, this what, is why oh, I need yeah. to run the computer from now on. Uh, yeah. We are totally fine with you running the computer, Greg. You are kind of the IT guy around here. Plus the heroin addict. Yeah, well, the the heroin addict no, IT. I don't guy. really like heroin. I, I like coke more. Oh, that's right. You did the heroin Crack. to come down from the coke. Right. right. Yeah, but uh, the heroin addict sounds more fun. <laughs> yeah, it does. <laughs> no, it's funnier. definitely not. <laughs> I don't understand the. I don't understand the point of it. I do. Uh, people are depressed. They need drugs to take them away from situations. Drugs are not bad. Okay. <laughs> does that sound right about uh, Greg? Yes. Uh, your life was in shambles. 
No, my life was really fucking awesome, actually. I just didn't know it. You were bored. <laughs> you just didn't know it. Right. That's like every person in the world. They just don't fucking know it yet. Uh, Greg, know. Greg Fl- thrives on chaos. Yeah, there was no chaos, so what's the best way? Put a needle in my arm. Yeah, yeah. you know, why not? And then, yeah, you, know, you know, sports on Sunday, needle <laughs> in the arm on Monday, whatever works. Right. What are you, you going to do for that heroin? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love God. this soundboard. <laughs> this is amazing. Like, can I use it, this all the time? It's a, no, it's a fifty dollars Android tablet. Go buy one. I don't have money right now. Honestly, honestly, Casey, if we rearrange the seats and Greg runs the computer, if you want to run the soundboard, be my guest. Uh, we don't really have to change. My wrist seats really right. hurts. Yeah, uh, Greg has uh, tendonitis. Um, yeah, I'm a doctor now. Too much. No, it's because I haven't worked in like ten fucking years. Yeah, <laughs> that's the problem. <laughs> yeah, I did that earlier, um, but with the other hand, so. Well, yeah, he is left-handed. But I, I was telling, I was telling Casey, um, because doctors are really expensive. So I went online to, uh, you know, I got my doctorate online today, and I self-diagnosed myself. I have tendonitis, um, and I tried writing a prescription to get uh, some Perk Thirties, and I went to the pharmacy, right, and they wouldn't give them to me. Um, they didn't recognize me as a doctor for whatever reason. Um, <laughs> so, so, so that I'm doctor stuck, I'm stuck for- with ibuprofen in this thing. So that doctorate from the uh, the 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 correspondence yeah, university yeah. from the uh, of American Samoa. Yeah, yeah, you know, they, didn't, they didn't recognize that it. So I didn't no. get any perks today, which makes me sad. You look like a character from uh, Kingpin. Did you ever see that movie? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's my pimp hand. Yeah, pimp hand. Imevala eight says hedge hedge. What the hedge fuck is hedge? She uh, likes hedge clippers. I guess. Mm. Uh, I don't know. She's probably like muscle. I gotta, I gotta use that down here. By the way, our, rough. our guest should be calling in in about five minutes if everything goes. Who is it? According to that, you, you know who it is. <laughs> no, I really, who is it? It's a matter of national security. I can't say it. The fuck does that mean? You'll see. Anyway, when our guest calls in here, you're going to see some weirdness as I switch cameras. So be prepared for that. Because we are have no idea what the fuck we're doing when it comes to setting up everything. We're, we're letting this motherfucker set everything up from now on. <laughs> I mean, he knows what he's doing. We, we just kind of like cobble it through. Yeah, we have no... Ideal. Sorry, that's fun. It is fun, isn't no, it? Not mine, no, no, Greg. No. Oh, come on, let him play with it a little bit. No. How do I get back? Oh, here Stingy we go. bastard. No, I don't want. I don't want to end up. You know, Greg getting prison flashbacks or whatever. No, like that. What, what do you got? What is no, this? No, no, no. There's the rim shot right there. Where? It says right rim, there. It's the button that's <laughs> there. Yeah, it says the. It's the button that says rim shot. There's so many buttons on here. Now I know why you can never find it. I'm gonna fuck Greg in Casey's bedroom. Casey doesn't even use his bedroom. Yeah, I don't even have a bedroom. To tell you the truth, uh, he has a mattress behind his couch. How ghetto is that shit? That's just for that's, sex. That's, <laughs> that's oh, that's the sex mattress. Yeah, that's the sex mattress. I sat on that thing once. Yeah, you do that in between pulls when you're writing. Yeah, just, <laughs> just uh, go on a mattress, bend her over, put it in her ass real quick, and then uh, start killing bosses again. That's how <laughs> but, it works. By the way, Trevor, we're we're po. So as soon as we cash out our latest Patreon, we'll send you your shirt out. I got your address. Thank you for that. Oh uh, yeah, that reminds me, Jay. Um, have your Jay gets the now. notifications for Patreon, and uh, he told me that you went up to twenty bucks, Trevor. So thank you. Yeah, you're oh, you're shit. you're a motherfucker. We are twenty piece now. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you're already you're already a badass. So I don't know where else to go, but I you right. earned yourself okay. a shirt. So. <laughs> what? No, that's too long. That's a long one. Oh. You can stop by pressing them again. That's a short one. There you go. <laughs> and this one too. Earn money. <laughs> I love money. that. That's from our very first. He was doing an impression of Lars Ulrich. Yeah, Ugh, money. <laughs> Fucking Lars, you tennis Denmark tennis cunt. Man, I hate him. You you know how you know fucking Budgie. <laughs> I love fucking Budgie. <laughs> fucking Lars Ulrich. Yeah, fuck them. What the fuck, fuck did they? They updated the app, and that's all fucking weird. What do you mean it's all weird? I don't know. Periscope, Periscope. You know what we need? Have you guys ever watched the McNasty Cast? They have a fucking electronic talking parrot. They even have a microphone for that motherfucker. That's crazy. We need to, uh, we, I mean, we got Greg. It's kind of like an electronic talking parrot. <laughs> we didn't even want to give Greg a microphone. That's pretty sad when a parrot gets one over him. <laughs> Why aren't you wearing your hipster glasses? Huh? These are not. These are fucking gangster glasses. You can only get these if you go to state prison. Yeah, see, I think Or Greg, Vision Max. Every time Greg... In the no. discount bin. <laughs> these were free. Every time except Greg, I had to pay two years for them. Two years. I <laughs> pay two years. Yeah. Is that how long you were in jail for? Two years? Uh, 18 months. Holy yeah. fuck, man. Most yeah. of it was in county. That's cool, though. Like, you're just out of time, basically, for Christmas. Christmas is coming up. You, uh, you know... Yeah. Oh, yeah. You have no money to buy anyone any gifts? No, I work now, so I'm going to have, like, $40. <laughs> $40. Yeah. 
Yeah. Go to the five and die. Oh, I owe so many people money. Oh, oh. oh. Hello? Hello there. Hello there. I think we're having, uh, we got an audio only. <laughs> you got you to gotta enable video. There we go. Give us one second. Oh, my God. Here. All right, hang on. There we go. There we are. Mr. President, thank you. Welcome for jo Welcome to our show. Thank you for joining us. Oh, it's a pleasure to be here at OHO Networks. <laughs> oh, we're, we're so glad you could take time out of your busy schedule to join us. We, we truly, truly appreciate it. Well, it's no problem. I'm, I'm actually in the washroom of Air Force One, so it would be a bit of a bumpy ride, you know. <laughs> <laughs> well, make sure you wash your hands. Uh, the 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 hands that are that are quite large, right? They're they're not tiny. That's right. These hands, I wash them in cold water and they shrink. <laughs> they they shrink in the cold water. That's right. So I use warm water. Warm. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely, you have to use the warm water, or else uh, the hands shrink. That's uh, right. Well, well, Mr. President, we have a couple of questions for you, if you don't mind us asking. Uh, what motivated you to run for president? Were you, you know, was this a, really something serious in your mind uh, that, that you actually thought you could win? Well, truthfully, what motivated me was the Russians. <laughs> uh, okay. to, 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 they, did, they showed me the money, okay? And I had to go for it because, you know, they just made it so good. You know, they're such good friends. And what's what's wrong with having an enemy as a friend? That's what I say. <laughs> so so it it was it was the money. That's right. <laughs> I spent no. I spent all their money on my campaign, and that's going to come out. You're going to see this in the next few days and weeks and months and years. You're going to see this coming out, and I'm letting you know firsthand. All right, that's what it was. Truth, because <laughs> I want to speak the truth. On OHO Network. Excuse me. Excuse me. You heard it here first, folks. <laughs> Sorry. Hold on. All right. Oh, apparently I wasn't supposed to say that. <laughs> uh, what? What? Oh, what, well. what? What you meant was you were trying to improve relations with Russia. Is that? Is that correct? Well, I never think before I speak. <laughs> I want to be as surprised as everyone else is by what comes out of this beautiful brain and out these lovely lips. Okay. They they are lovely, sir. They 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 are lovely. Thank you. Uh, so uh, one of the news stories I've been seeing this week is uh, you and Melania have been decorating for uh, the White House for Christmas. Uh, some some of those those nasty people in the media have been saying that uh, her decorations are creepy or Thank gothic you. looking. What do you think about that? First of all, I want to congratulate First Lady Melania. She did a great job with the white dead trees and the white bulbs and you know it's very difficult to decorate in white there's so many different types of white bulbs you know <laughs> there's cold white there's cool white and she used the very best pure white pure great white job, pure, great that's job. gotta cost a lot pure white is the very best is that what you're very saying best. and she got all pure white you know we love christmas because i said Right from the beginning, when I'm president, I'm going to say Merry Christmas. No more happy holidays. Merry Christmas. Well, that is after a big all, issue. After all, you know, Mary was the mother of the baby Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> without Mary, it's just Christmas. And without Chris, it's just mess. So I'm here to save Christmas. So you're here I, to clean up the mess? That's right. That was pretty good. Well, I thought, well, that, that was time for the rim shot, Casey. We love, we love Where is it? Too late. We love Christmas. We really do. Well, we we, uh, we love Christmas, too. We're glad you're here to and it's, can take some time I, out of here. I just wanted to share some of my songs that we that we love in the White House. Oh, please, by all means. Love, we all love them. Don Jr., his favorite song is Little Dumber Boy. <laughs> Eric, his favorite song is Rudolph the Red-Nosed Commie. <laughs> and Melania, her favorite Christmas song is All I Want for Christmas is to be a divorcee. Right? <laughs> and my my favorite song, my very best Christmas song, I'm Dreaming of a White Christmas. 
<laughs> those, so we, celebrate, we celebrate Christmas in a big way. The, those are excellent selections. Those oh, are excellent. By the, way, by the way, sure. Happy holidays, all right? <laughs> well, Merry Christmas. So, uh, so there's been a lot of uh, allegations of sexual misconduct from everyone from mega producer Hi- Harvey uh, Weinstein to uh, politicians like Al Franken. What are your thoughts on all that? Well, you know, first of all, uh, it's sexual harassment is what I think is it's, it's abominable, and I I think really, truly, and honestly, you know, when I was head of the uh, the Miss America contest, you know, I used to walk in and see the girls, you know, because I was checking up on their uniforms, right? Right. See you the, you have to make sure everything's up to par. That that's right. And I, I made sure that I treated them with the utmost respect, you know, when I felt them up. But that was, you know, <laughs> that was before I was president. I was, a, you know, you know, this allegation of uh, Billy Bush, you know, what he said, you know, about me. Right. You got to remember, I was in my mid-60s then. I was just, you know, sowing wild oats. You're just a young man. That's right. You know, and I was, you know, it was locker room talk. And, uh, and I'm sorry for what I said. But as president, I abhor that kind of talk and behavior, you know. Of course. And, uh, it, there's no place, there's no place in that for that kind of behavior. Really, seriously, there is no place. You know, keep your hands to yourself. You know, that's what I say. Take take the Paul Rubens approach. Keep your hands to yourself. <laughs> that's right. You know, in a theater, I don't care where. You know. <laughs> Anywhere the mood strikes you. Or keep your hands in your popcorn. I don't know. Just, <laughs> Well, do you have anything else you'd like to add, Mr. President? Well, I just want to say that I'm really, really, really thrilled to be, you know, here for my first Christmas as president. It, it really is, you know, seeing all the people, you know, it really is a thrill. And, I, and I'm just so happy to be on your show because, you know, you guys... You know, I've been watching your show very closely, very closely. And, you know, I'm going to have you guys up at the White House for sure. Fantastic. That sounds awesome. We <laughs> accept. We accept. I don't think I'm allowed job. to go, actually. <laughs> Great job. Hey, how about a pardon for him? Yeah. Can we get a pardon? He's been to jail. Get him a pardon. <laughs> yeah, I need, I need help. Well, you know, first of all, uh, homosexuals have the gay kind. <laughs> you know, women have the... Uh, you know, the gender card. And uh, minorities have the, the race card. Now that I'm president of the United States of America, I have the get out of jail free card. Yes, I need that. Can, can we start calling it the Trump card? <laughs> That's right. Trump card. And I may be using it very shortly. <laughs> All right. I'm playing that card a lot quicker than I thought. So right. What I need to do is run for president. Yes, but not for another eight years. Got it. Four more months. Four more months. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, I'm sure you have, have tons of business you need to attend to, Mr. President, but we thank you so much for taking time out of your day to join us. Yes, thank you very yeah. much. Yes, You're thank welcome. you. You're welcome. And you guys, you have a blessed Christmas, all right? You too. You do the same. Thank you very much for joining us. Have a good one. See you, Mr. President. Thank you too. Goodbye. Bye. Bye. Hi. What do you? Th- that was actually awesome. <laughs> what did you think of that? We were joined by the fucking president. Oh, the merry, the that, merry that was Christmas pretty... thing was actually pretty fun. <laughs> <laughs> so you, you guys, Casey was a little worried about this. It was actually pretty good. <laughs> I wasn't worried. I just know that we technologically have trouble <laughs> with Skype and stuff. We're terrible, but you know, but uh, when Mr. President wants something, yeah, went pretty well you fucking that. do what Mr. President wants. It's just the way yeah, it is. Especially if he's going to get me out of jail yeah. the next time I go. Definitely. Always, right. Always got to get him out of jail. No, that, that was... Uh, and free drugs. We should have asked him for free drugs. <laughs> now, actually, I'm sure he's got some oh, drugs. Oh, yeah, definitely. CIA. Oh, absolutely. The CIA's bringing all that shit in. Damn. I didn't Can we call that, him back? I didn't know there were so many shades of white, though, actually, to tell you the truth. <laughs> well, uh, if anybody knows about which is the best shade of white, it's it's Donald Trump. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like a beige white or a Cheeto white. A <laughs> Cheeto white. Actually, that sounds like something uh, Bob Ross would use. Gonna use a little Cheeto white little, on this tree Cheeto here. white <laughs> to give it some flavor. Yes, Trevor, white Christmas. It's gonna be a white Christmas. <laughs> we're bringing at my house. It is. Yeah. We're bringing back uh, the 
the tradition of saying Merry Christmas because it's Trump's America, so whatever. Actually, uh, Jay, do you remember when we were coming up with the things to blame Donald Trump for? Uh, yes. It was Damn It Donald. Damn It Donald. We actually have the Damn It Donald t-shirt. <laughs> nice segue, by the way. Thank you, thank you. I still see uh, people saying, uh, um, what was Obama's thing? Thanks, Obama. Yeah, thanks, Obama. I don't think it caught on yet. It's just, I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. It don't matter. None yeah. of this matters. Jay, so, Jay's trying to fix shit. Why yeah. the show? What are you He's trying to fucking... fix, Jay? Uh, somehow we lost half of the scroll. <laughs> oh, Probably right. because you unplugged your computer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. Uh, our, our our special guest there, Mr. Donald Trump, uh, he runs a site called uh, Trumped Up News, which you can find actually on the Twitter handle at Club Sandwich. <coughs> At Club Sandwich, as in the food. <laughs> uh, I don't know why he does that instead of his uh, at real Donald Trump. But hey, there you go. Uh, so yeah, that was uh, that was fun. That yeah. was that was good. I, I'm 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 pleasantly surprised. I thought uh, you know I've been kind of a vocal anti-Trump type of person. Uh, I'm surprised he didn't try to have me arrested. <laughs> <laughs> I thought for sure he was. UJ try to anti-Trump. Arrest. I would have never thought. I know. <laughs> Well, I, I, I don't know. I got to say though, we had an excellent conversation. I, I maybe I'm tired. Maybe the tides are turning. <laughs> maybe the tides. Are I, I'm just waiting for Jason to come in here and be like, "Fucking commie." <laughs> <laughs> well, we invited. We had the president on the show. How can I possibly be? You yeah, know? that's very true. Very, very, very true. I just realized being on this side how much quieter your mic is than mine. Yeah, Jeff. I told you. <laughs> Nobody listens to me. Actually, that's- we switched them. Oh, you did? Yeah. So it must it's be yours. your microphone then. You did throw your microphone. I did. One I episode. did. I chucked that thing like a fucking like a javelin one day. <laughs> Why did you throw it? I forget. Because it was funny. Oh, okay. Same reason I do most things. Greg's over here chewing. It's delicious. He just got back from a NASCAR race. So fucking he's, Copenhagen. He's uh, chewing yeah. Copenhagen satisfaction since eighteen twenty two. So we ta- it's, no. it's delicious. I mean, I we like talked to Donald Trump. We live in the woods. Greg's chewing Copenhagen. What's next? <laughs> oh crap. I thought that was my water. <laughs> I was like, Jay's computer is done. <laughs> no, Jay is just really, really loud. No, it's not even that I'm loud. I just talk really close to the microphone. How's uh? I was just over at uh, Ashley, the neighbor's house, um, like 20 minutes before the show or something like that, maybe a little longer. But uh, she was cooking food. How was the food, Ashley? You were cooking like chicken and... I think there were sweet potatoes or something. Oh, fuck, I'm hungry as shit. Can I go over? <laughs> they probably have extras. They always make more food than they can fucking handle. It's crazy. Well, as often as they're at the restaurant, I figured Ashley couldn't cook to save her life. <laughs> Apparently she can. She can. She can. Not a lot of people like it, but she can. <laughs> <laughs> kind of like our guest presidency. Yes. He can do it. Not a, not a lot of people like it. But No, I'm just joking, Ashley. Everyone gives you a bad rap, but I, I actually I don't have a problem with your cooking at all. I think it's great. People make me food. I'm not going to fucking complain at all. You'll still complain. No, I won't. No, I won't. It's because you're a bitch. No. No. I had I had this girl I know make me tacos last week, and it was amazing. I had a bitch once. Your girlfriend. No. This I'll admit it. Yeah. She's not my fucking girlfriend, girlfriend. man. She's okay. All right. All right. Let's go through the checklist. She comes over a lot and hangs out, right? Check. Uh, you guys come over and hang a lot. Am I fucking you I guys? I come here once a fucking week for right. an hour. She hasn't been here in like a week. R- right, I'm just saying. she come to her house, but... <laughs> Same thing. Okay, so you guys see each other most days. Yeah, no, not really. Every other day? No, not really. Three more times, than, three, more times than three times a week. I haven't seen her today. Three times a week? No. Yeah, you haven't seen her yet today. Okay, okay so check. we so, just check that one off. That's so, good. yeah, you, you spend the evenings together. Why do you have to say, like, evenings? Like, we're fucking ballroom dancing and drinking wine. <laughs> They're having a wonderful evening. Okay. Yes. Let, Money. Let's rephrase it another way. You fuck. So? Girl, there's a lot of people that aren't right girlfriend there. and boyfriend. Chelsea said, right, that, that's confirmed. Cause, that's because Chelsea just wants to go to the wedding. She thinks that we're going to get married or some shit. Well, yeah, that's usually, you go girlfriend and then marriage. That, no. That's generally the way things that's, proceed. No, you usually go from meeting each other to girlfriend to having a baby, then control, getting married. <laughs> yeah. To are you, uh, you know, will you go down in the basement, grab me something, and you push her down the steps? <laughs> All right then. You know what's, you know what's the worst thing about breaking down outside of abortion clinic, Greg? What? Going inside asking for a hanger. <laughs> you, you know what else is terrible? <laughs> you trying to change the subject, right? Eh, there is no subject. Actually, there. the neighbor says they're together like every day. Yeah, every no, day. We're not. And I like how that's... she said it like a five-year-old, like every day. 
<laughs> he's always there. I've seen him every day for the last week now, I think. Yeah, no. okay. Check uh-huh. that one off. Check. Okay, so you spend a lot of time together. You have sex with one another. You have some sort of feelings for one another. I'd say that's pretty much there. Who said yeah. there was feelings involved? You. No. And every time I say the word feelings, I have to bleep it out. Because <laughs> I don't like that word. I don't think I like him having the soundboard. Oh, I love it, dude. It's amazing. Even Trevor knows. It's a $50 knows. Android tablet. Just go buy one. Like, this is what I think of love. <laughs> <laughs> and hold on one more. I found it. Where is it? i got to find it again. Give me, give me a sec here. Where's the toilet bowl? <laughs> it's, Never. I don't oh, know. It's there here somewhere. It okay. <laughs> That's what I think of love. It's shit. They hang out and not fuck. See... Ashley, well, that's definitely we hang out and not fuck. That's because there's not like time for it. Like, I'll come over, we'll like watch TV, and then like it's like in midnight, and she has to work in the morning, so it's like we just we forget about it. Like, so you, you that? That? sorry, <laughs> you have company with, with her with no intention of fucking, even though you occasionally fuck. That's because we're both that's a girlfriend. That's a girlfriend. No, no, yes, no, it's not a girlfriend unless you make it official. We Don't make, make it me official. ask Google. <laughs> fuck Google. Yeah, just like it worked out real well with your hand there. <laughs> it does. It feels a lot better. It does. Right now. That's what you should be, Greg. You should be a doctor. Yeah. He already like knows how to prescribe medication. <laughs> yeah. I'm surprised, though, that you just didn't get on MD and you're like, my wrist hurts. And they're like, you have anal leakage. <laughs> <laughs> you have that, that, watery no, eyes. That's, that's, that's from prison. Yeah, that's what most people find. They're like, I have a sore throat. You have cancer. <laughs> I could have cancer in my wrist. Well, you are bald. Right. <laughs> you should actually, every sh- episode, you should wear a different wig. You should, you <laughs> that be, would like, be great. Yeah, you should get into wigs. That, that would be amazing. But are you, did we have a bot? No, I'm just looking know. back at some of the because I couldn't see uh, see the chat when uh, our our guest was joining oh, us here. That's right. Nobody yeah. was really talking. No, but uh, somebody with the the handle Conserva Gal joined and we actually watched this Conserva Gal. So apparently, uh, it sounds like a brand of underwear. <laughs> apparently, we just made her day with our live Trump interview. <laughs> I can't. I she can't believe seem to be here anymore. Though I can't believe people actually like put their affiliation of what. Um, a uh, political party there. That's how screaming. fucked up. <laughs> like, That's how fucked up the world is. I can't serve a gal. I keep seeing like I keep seeing like all this shit like liberal this or the. That's so or, weird, man. Why? Or the the one I saw the other day that made me just nod my head in shame was Miss Deplorable. Like, oh my god. Oh Jesus Christ, man! It's like you do it. Like I understand you're trying to, you know. Okay, Hillary called him a basket of deplorable. You do realize that deplorable is a shitty person, right? <laughs> Like you might as well just like change your uh, change your Twitter handle to uh, Raving Cunt Bag. That's the thing though. These at, days, at Raving Cunt Bag. But... <laughs> That's the thing though. These days, it's it's good to be a f- like to fail. <laughs> like good timing. I, yeah, I know. I see like all these people, especially women. Women are so bad with it. They're posted all over Facebook. <laughs> I'm such a crazy person. Like they're bragging that they're crazy. I'm like, when is it good? Did you to ever be... hear yourself talk? What? <laughs> yeah. No. It's like, my life is terrible. It is terrible, but I don't say I'm crazy. Yeah, you do. I use the word insane. (laughs) (laughs) We're all nuts. We just, it depends how much you want to show it or not. That's what I believe. But it's just, like, I see all those, that Marilyn Monroe quote all the time. Oh, if you can't handle me, she never said that. Whatever. You know what the fuck I mean. Who said it? I know, but she never said it. Who said it? Do you know? Some asshole on some other whore probably. some other whore that was fucking a president <laughs> the sex <laughs> Happy kennedy <titles. laughs> birthday, mr president speaking of people fucking presidents can we talk for a moment about melania no people are giving melania a bunch of shit though you know what her gold digger and stuff and like all this of sort course of shit. she is Dude, she deserves every penny of it. Yeah, if I had to fuck that fucking... <laughs> oh, I mean, she has to run around the White House with his old orange dick flopping around. Yeah, dude, you imagine sucking that dick and those salt and pepper pubes are hitting you in the face, dude? Oh, uh, they're not even salt and pepper. <laughs> he's, he's about to puke. Like, <laughs> like, she has to sit there while, while a 300-pound man with a bad comb over plows her. Yeah, it, it probably, <laughs> like, he, she, de- she deserves a payout. His pubes Should probably... I start look- doing a comb over? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start that. The comb over. That bring it back. Great. Yeah. You should bring the comb over back. You bring it back. I don't see a lot of them anymore. Yeah, I bet you, like, Donald Trump's pubes look like a ball of, like, orange silly string. 
<laughs> yeah. Dude, he's probably so old they've fallen out. Oh, yeah, heard probably, that happens. Probably. It looks like his dick has cancer. <laughs> I mean, could you just imagine her just having to lay there and take it? Uh, yeah, but dude, she deserves every penny. Women love money, man. She well, she deserves every penny of it. Yeah, like imagine how many women. Like, say you're at the mall and you're just walking, you know, down the mall, or whatever, and they're like, "Hey, would you marry Donald Trump? You can have all the money you want in the world." I, I would. Like ninety percent. I yeah, I would too. Right. Yeah, I'd be like, I let him fuck me in my ass for all the money absolutely. in the world. But you know what though, Melania never, never uh, planned on that shit happening. Like, oh my God, you mean he he actually fucking won? Well, the funny thing is, is I don't think he knew he was gonna win. No, he didn't. He does this every few years to sell books. Yeah. He had a book out. Exactly. And somehow he won. Yeah. Even I, he was like, well, shit. Yeah. <laughs> now we got to do, do something. Now? Well, she knew he was going to win because she told him, she goes, are you sure you want to do this? I remember um, them talking about this. And he goes, why? Of course I want to do this. She goes, because you know you're going to win, right? And he goes, ah, he just like brushed it off. Yeah. There's no, <laughs> he's run before. It's not like he's never done this before. It's just the the political climate has been so full of jokers and stupid people for so long that he had a shot. Yeah, like me and Jay. It's like, were, why not actually elect an actual joker? Yeah. Like me and Jay were talking about this. Other countries, they get with their families and they have like a an American political night. Oh yeah, they watch it like uh, yeah, popcorn and shit. Yeah, like fucking it's fucking like, horse racing. Yeah, it's like when people get in, I don't know what cool TV shows are playing these days. Shameless, I don't know. And, and they get together and they watch Ooh. these politics like. You know, like we watch fucking daytime football. TV. Yeah, like football or the Super Bowl. <coughs> Oops, I mentioned a bowl. Greg, don't, don't get flat. I don't smoke weed. <laughs> smoke crack. <laughs> smoke crack. <laughs> so I, I love this. I love this. I'm sorry. <laughs> you know, I had, a, I had a conversation with my mom a while ago, and we were talking about Anna Nicole Smith. Remember her? Oh, yeah. yeah you she know. used to be really good looking, and then she just turned into like... She got real fat, and then she like, got skinny again. Yeah, and she just looked like old couch material. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. well, just, ugh. well, she married that guy and then got all of his money. I forget his name. Was, so he, she, you know, was he in a wheelchair, or was he just really fucking old? I forget which. It's been so long, but yeah. she's like, oh, she really loved him. I'm like, Mom, are you fucking that dumb? I, I don't know. Like, she didn't love him. She <laughs> loved his money, and you know what? He wasn't stupid. He knew what was going on. Yeah, dude. And, and the and the funny thing is, is like I hear all these women talk about how hard they have it and shit like that. And I'm like, dude, if I could fuck for money, I would. Oh like, my god, yeah. Jesus, man. If I'm low on I'd money, I'd be a hooker. Yeah, exactly. If, if I'm low on money, I just have to wear some cleavage, and then I can go to the bar and get a guy to buy me free drinks. I can't do that as a dude. Who wants to see dick cleavage? <laughs> I think we should be able to hang our balls out and attract mates. Yeah, it's just it's it's ridiculous. And it's just like, oh man, I don't know. Pay gap, feminism, all that bullshit. Well, you know what I, I would I would do if I could get away with it, I'd still be a cam girl, you know? Like that's I know. those people don't even have to leave their house. I know, and the funny thing is, just is take their clothes off for a bunch of desperate idiots. Yeah, and the funny thing is it's even getting lazy because what they do is, is they buy these USB like Bluetooth dildos. Okay. Wait, and what? They, yeah, it's a uh, Bluetooth dildo that you can buy. Do tell. What do you? Why? Because what Casey's you do is single. He has time for this. Oh God, yeah. See, he you have admitted one? I'm single. He admitted I'm single. I am. <laughs> well, you protest if I don't. Um. So what they do is, is they have these Bluetooth dildos and they sit on them. And what happens is, is these people that get into these cam chat rooms, they donate uh, coins, and each coin I think is like five cents or something like that. So every time people donate, it vibrates. It turns the dildo on. So these people don't even have to, like, um, do any work. The chat basically gets them off by donating. And I remember I watched this one where this little Asian girl, dude, she looked like she weighed, like, 30 pounds. Like, just... We're and starting it, to learn a little bit about Casey's preferences <laughs> right now. No, actually, the funny thing is, is I was watching this with all the people I play WoW with. <laughs> this is what we do on our downtime is we watch cam videos. In between pools, right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Ew. Yeah, in between pools, you know what I mean? <laughs> so... Um, every time that a someone donates, it makes a noise. It makes a cha-ching noise, okay? So that's how you know someone donates. So I'm sitting here watching this poor girl, and the stream is just... <laughs> like, just chinging. Like, she's making thousands of dollars, okay? That's how fast this is going. She is so losing control over her body. It soaked her couch. Like, this bed shit thing she was on, it was drenched. She was losing so yeah, much. Yeah, well, you know what? She could afford to dry clean it. <laughs> <I know. laughs> 
she was losing so much body fluid. I think she like orgasm into a hangover. <laughs> like, everyone was like, you Gotta know, re-hydrate. cheering her on and stuff. And I was like, someone get that woman a Gatorade. <laughs> like I was so, I felt so bad for her, man. Like, ah, uh, it just, I don't know. It's just times have changed, I guess. I don't know. Like I've mentioned before, when people get drunk these days, they soak tampons in vodka and put them in their assholes. Like, whatever happened to just... get really drunk doing that. Oh, yeah. Whatever happened to just sitting around and having a couple beers with your friends? Smoking some crack, too. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, a little crack. But now, I don't Shooting know. Shooting a little heroin. Yeah. Got a li- taking a little crack, shoving a tampon up your crack. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Whatever. I just, I just don't get it. Random rim shot for no reason. <laughs> Yeah, well, th- uh, this is mine now. You're done. No, You're let, done. let him You're have done. a chance. You're no. done. Let me have a chance. At least play the Alex I'm gonna Jones. I'm going to start turning these things. Let me have a chance. There you go. <laughs> I need I need all the chances I can di- get cuz life hasn't given me. We are going to turn <laughs> We are going to turn over the electronics to you eventually, Greg. Yeah, That's we should. Bad idea. We need to make sure you weren't going to pawn them for coke money. <laughs> I have I a job should. now. I don't have to pawn anything. It's awesome. How, do you work full time? Yeah. I mean, I'm a temp still, but Mm-hmm. Well, so I'm probably going to get promoted. Like, I worked there a week, and they're already offering me this better job. It doesn't hurt that your mom's in HR. No, nah, that had nothing to do with it. <laughs> Seriously. HR. She wrote me up for being late when I worked there before. You remember that? <laughs> she yeah. Really she don't, she don't pull no weight from me. The only, thing, the only thing that I know uh, like, is when new jobs are coming out of bids and stuff like that. That's all. I don't you get, get the insider story. info on yeah. it. Yeah. That is fucking hilarious. Your mom. Yeah, she wrote, wrote me up for being late. Yeah. How, so uh, this was Tuffy. I mean, I used yeah. to be late a lot. So. Yeah. <laughs> Tuffy's bragging. What's he bragging about? He says, uh, "I'm on the board of badasses here." <laughs> Talking to Latina Angel Thirteen. Hello, Latina Angel Thirteen. Hello, welcome. welcome. Any any friend of Tuffy's is a friend of ours. Yes. Oh, she's not actually thirteen watching this shit. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, whatever. We don't please, have an age. If you're thirteen, in. please contact yeah, your please, parents. Please turn this off now. If they're still alive, I don't know. <laughs> oh, are you now? She says. <laughs> He actually is, yes. He it's because he he parted with his hard earned cash for us. Yes, and we we wholeheartedly appreciate it. And because, I spend it on drugs. Yeah, Greg <laughs> spends it on Sorry. cocaine. Yeah, we, we we feel bad though, Trevor. Like we we really want you to fuck Greg. We just we live far away from you, buddy. <laughs> Yo, uh, I, I got something cool to plug real quick. By the way, butt plug. Uh, I came across a, a video today. It fucking made me laugh my ass off on YouTube. It's um, uh, they they're doing this heavy metal uh, he- heavy metal like night night show uh you know like in the vein of uh you know the late show or something like that it's called uh two minutes uh two minutes to late night there's two episodes out jesus christ that is the best name yeah oh my god they're wearing corpse paint and shit mutoid man is playing is the house band two minutes till midnight that is great they record they recorded uh two episodes of the show in saint vitus Mm -hmm. which is that is a classic metal club in new york city if you haven't got a chance to check it out look for it it's two minutes to late night it's fucking hilarious. I, I got to give a round of applause for that day. Yeah, <laughs> they had uh, they had the guitar player from uh, the Dillinger Escape Plan on the first one, and then uh, this one they had uh, John Baisley from uh, from uh, why can't I think of the name Baroness Baroness. They were uh, it's pretty fucking cool. <laughs> so if you guys get a chance, check that out. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Wait, why haven't we ever played uh, music from Kill the Messenger? It's I gotta be around it's somewhere, gone. right? Yeah, it's, it's gotta be somewhere. I dude. tried to embarrass that, him with it one day. That, it's gone. That was so long ago. Like it was I actually pretty good, though. I know. I that's. I guess. You I know, know what? It was funny. good. You know what's funny? Casey over here. You, you've heard him laugh. He sounds like a fucking Disney character. <laughs> <laughs> when he sings, he sounds like Satan pissing out barbed wire. It's really fucking good. <laughs> No, uh, it's in the red, but I didn't hit here. Jesus Christ! See, it, it shuts off when this the, that pig um, the peak. Maybe someday I'll try to find it. I think I've it's got to be somewhere. Somewhere. I just I yeah, don't. Yeah, I used to have it all. I don't know what the fuck I happened to it. It was know. on the internet for the longest time. I was able to play it, and now it's gone. Yeah, back when uh, MySpace. MySpace. Everyone actually, MySpace was a shit when, we, when I was in a band. That's how we used the tour. Like we went on tours and we used MySpace for it all. Well, you remember? Yeah. You remember that time? We, where were we going? We went to Harrisburg. I went to Harrisburg uh, to do a show or whatever, and and that black girl gets out of that fucking van because you wouldn't uh, turn. Black girl came out you of. You don't remember van. that? That no. shit was crazy. Oh, we is she we gonna, gonna whoop die. your ass? Yeah, because Casey was lost. He didn't know where the fuck we were going, so uh-huh. he stayed at the light and didn't go nowhere. <laughs> and this lady behind us gets out of the fucking van and starts oh. walking towards us. He's about ready to tire iron him. Right? <laughs> <laughs> about ready to tire iron him in the, in the skull. 
Hey, uh, I, and you I were do sick not. as shit for that show too. It oh, still fucking it. sounded good. Uh, really? Yeah. Well, you know when you're ever. vomiting, yeah, yeah, it sounds sounds pretty much the same yeah. as his vocals. Yeah, I, I think I just sang like this. Money. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. Yeah. 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 I don't know. Maybe, maybe help carry all the shit in. Yeah. That, you, actually, we really appreciated that because we hated it. <laughs> and, and the sad thing was... Well, I got in for free. Well, so well who the hell was there to carry Gordon's ego? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> that's, that's what the... <laughs> yeah, where's the rip shot? That was the heaviest. Yeah. God, we should find that fat piece of shit and bring him in here and just beat him up. <laughs> we, we need to find... See, uh... Yeah, he'll piss on your fucking Gord- yeah. Yeah. Gordon's the kind of guy who referred to himself by all three of his names. <laughs> I'm not going to go into it because yeah, you know. I almost said it. Once. No, I remember when I used to hang out with him and people were like, hey, who are you? He'd be like, how dare you not know who I am? I'm like, you are so gay. He is such <laughs> a fucking piece of shit that he uh, he wouldn't even have a bass player in the band because yeah. he didn't want somebody else to steal his thunder. Yeah, like, so he played through the a bass player doesn't steal metal. any thunder anyway. Yeah, exactly. They, yeah. they bring the thunder. <laughs> We we were a three piece. It was me singing, Greg playing guitar, and a drummer. That's all we had. Not Greg, Gordon. Gordon. Yeah, no. We me. tried. Gordon, to get him I was supposed to play bass, but and we Gordon a, wasn't having it. Yeah, and we had a drummer, and uh, Greg or Greg. God damn it, Gordon got an octave pedal and just put like everything he played in the guitar. It played through another speaker at a lower. You know. <laughs> yeah, he put it in a. He put it on an ampeg, I believe. And it's just, oh god, he was such an egotistical fucking cocksucker, dude. Like what, he was good though. So yeah, he's well, good, he but good. Every being good doesn't good. make you doesn't. There's plenty of good guitar players out there. Good humble ones though. They're hard to find. Yeah, I just yeah, and that's the thing. Like he wasn't humble at all. He was just like, yeah, pick guitar, yeah. I shred. Mm, yeah, it's like fuck you, dude. I remember I was writing a song <laughs> with him one day. We were trying to put a project together. I was trying to write a song with him. He's like, oh, I like that. That sounds good. But here, do this and do that and change this and change that. I'm like, dude, these aren't even the same notes I know. anymore. <laughs> By the end of it. We're not even in the same scale as I started <laughs> with. Let me play it. <laughs> yeah. And then, uh, like, you we know, aren't even in the that. same key. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I, that was bad times. I let him live with me, too. And it was just. Yeah, that was a stupid idea. It was such a fail. <laughs> <laughs> I love this stuff. It's so amazing. It, it, he pissed all over everything. <laughs> he did. Yeah. Fucking used to come to my house and drink and piss all over everything I own. Did he ever piss on? Did he ever come to your house, Greg, and piss on something? No. We always went. We always went to uh, Joe's house or Jay's. <laughs> Joe's house. <laughs> yeah. Did you know Gordon really well? Not, not really. Yeah. Not like they weren't like best of friends or anything. Yeah, yeah. I mean, he hung around the same as we did. Yeah, I'm surprised him and Joe lasted as long because he treated Joe like shit all the time. Oh, dude. Joe threatened to kick his ass many times. No, that's probably why. <laughs> In fact, uh, whenever Gordon would get uppity, Joe would kick his ass, and then he'd be fine for a while. Yeah, and then they'd break something off the wall and they'd fix it with peanut butter. <laughs> <laughs> My head was one of those objects. Yeah, these fuckers would put like. Rip part of the drywall down and stuff like that, and put peanut butter on it and fix it before Joe's mother got home. Uh, Tuffy asks, "When is the patron only broadcast? Uh, probably next week, but unfortunately, Greg's not going to be able to join us for him anymore. I got to make vacuums. Yeah, he's got it. He works third shift, so he doesn't really have time to stick around anymore. Yeah, the patron only podcast. Yeah. We uh, plan on doing them either the first or second uh, week. Whenever the hell we get around, it's, it's when we. I just time. record me working. Yeah, I think I think we might. <laughs> I think we might play another video game. Do you guys? Dig that shit when we did that and, uh, you know, threaten to strangle each other with uh, Nintendo controllers. I fun. I, I think we should definitely hit up some Mario Kart or something. Mario Kart would be fun. Right, I, might, I, I might have to call off work for that. <laughs> oh, you a big Mario Kart fan? Fuck yeah. You love oh, It is fun, dude. I don't have a third controller, though. It could be a problem. I was playing. It uh, don't matter. I just want to be there. <laughs> he just, he's like, I just want to soak it I'll all just, I'll just stand in the background and smoke. I get, I get really turns. competitive, though, with Mario Kart. Like, I was playing uh, on DS with Jay's kids, and, like, she was, like, beating me, and I was, like, wanting to go over and, like, push her off her stool. <laughs> <laughs> like a 10 year old. You need another tit cake, Tuffy says. Yeah. Uh, yeah. My wife uh, lovingly baked that for us. Yeah. That's, that icing was fucking. That icing was so good, but instant heartburn. <laughs> like, I, I took one bite of that icing. I was like, that's so. Oh, Jesus. I Christ. wish I had saved the box of the of the fucking cake. Yeah, yeah what would you say? Like it was the, like 50 cent. Oh, uh, dude. It was like the ghettoest shit ever. It looked like it was made in 1939. <laughs> it probably was. The box was just. There's so much preservatives and shit in food these days. Like it probably was. probably was. Yeah, <laughs> it was Surefine brand. I think is what it was, but it was terrible. Surefine. That's Surefine. That's, that's how I used to hit on ladies. Like you sure you, are fine. You sure are fine. Mm, yes. And then she, you know, cut my dick off or call the cops on me. Um, or becomes your sister. Yeah. Or one of those. Um, Whoa. Casey's ex girlfriend is Whoa. his sister now. Oh Step. right. Step. Oh right. I forgot Step. about that. Step. 
Let's grab the railing. And it doesn't matter. Up here. Still, look, the word <laughs> sister is still involved. Yeah, they make porns about that. Yeah, now, now now Thanksgiving is awkward. Yeah, so I don't really celebrate of course, uh, a lot of holidays. Of course, what, Brittany would have been a sister-in-law? I guess. Who's Brittany? That's legal, though, right? Who's Brittany? You don't re- uh, the crazy bitch. The one that pulled a gun on Joe? His, was that his girlfriend? No, his that was brother, his. His brother's wife's, brother's sister. wife's sister. Oh, yeah. Oh, Jimmy. Okay. Jimmy Knapp. Yo, what's up, Jimmy? How you doing, man? You missed the fun earlier. Jason's remember Jimmy? too. Oh, what's up, Jason? What's up? You remember Jimmy? You, Jimmy? you guys. The guy with the thick glasses? Oh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I remember. He broke a leg at our show. Really? Yeah. He fucking, <laughs> Literally. He came to our show, and he had a fucking cane. And I was like, dude, uh, what happened? He's like, oh, you know, I, I, I sprained my ankle or something like that, so I got to go light on it. So we started playing the show. He threw his cane and got in the washroom <laughs> and ended up breaking his leg. <laughs> he it was, was fucking that, cool. That was my first show ever, and I was like, people break bones over this? This is <laughs> yeah. awesome. And I was hooked ever since. Oh, you, Jimmy did not miss the fun earlier. Did you Did you see our our special guest? Were you Were you lurking? <laughs> yeah. The special guest is uh, Mr. my ego, Mr. President. <laughs> Actually, I do. Uh, okay, Gordon, we're getting ready to <laughs> we're getting ready to end the show, unfortunately. But I gotta I gotta actually uh, go ahead and give out the real props here. Uh, our guest this uh, evening was Glenn Griffith. He is a stand up comedian who just did that uh, impression of President Trump. But he also does a wide range of other voices. If you uh, you or anybody you know want to book him for an appearance or anything like that, uh, his name's Glenn Griffith at gmail dot com. And you Very can find funny. him on Facebook at uh, Glenn.Griffith2 and Twitter at Club Sandwich. We'll also, uh, for those of you who are watching on YouTube down the road, we're also going to share all that on, uh, on uh, you know, the description. Shit. We're on YouTube? Yeah, yeah, we got a YouTube channel. Yeah, we've had a YouTube we put, channel ever since. We put all of our archives up on YouTube because after a while, uh, Periscope deletes them. Yeah, so if anyone ever wants to watch a older episode, just get on YouTube. It's, it's just type in open and hostile opinions and follow us on there. Well, it, it, it's YouTube uh, slash C slash openly hostile opinions. I assume the C stands for cunt. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you can remember I love it. that word. Such a we great word. We were on YouTube. <laughs> fucking. You fucking. No, <laughs> no, we're allowed to be on YouTube. We're just not allowed to monetize it because our shit is filthy. Yeah. And it's all Why right. Why not? Though. What the fuck is wrong with the internet we're, these days? We're not advertising. Net neutrality, for... that's what's wrong with the fucking Jesus. internet. No, the, the <laughs> fact they're trying to take it away. Yeah, that's fucking bullshit. This is racist as fuck, and I hope I don't get in trouble for saying it, but I, <laughs> I saw something the other day. It made me laugh my ass off. It was a picture of Ajit Pai, who's the chairman of the FCC. Yeah. It said Ajit Pai is the, uh, is the end boss you have to fight after you fight all the Indian spammers. <laughs> Oh, Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> You're going to edit that part out, right? No. no. That's not right. racist. Right. It Jay is. Jay has but... four black tires on his car. He's with... <laughs> oh, my God. I don't even Jay doesn't have a car, have a car anymore. anymore. Oh, that's right. He's selling it. Actually, Jay's old car was black. He ain't racist. <laughs> yeah, and it's also falling apart. <laughs> uh, whatever. This yeah, shit right. happens. Falling apart like my life. <laughs> so sometime this week, I'm going to get up our uh, Christmas only <laughs> Christmas only shirts. I got a, got a couple of cool ones coming in the pipes. Uh, yeah, for those of you guys who, who don't know, have just been watching us on Periscope, yeah, we are available on YouTube. Uh, we, we put out a high-resolution vi- version of this on YouTube yes. that Casey so lovingly edits. I don't know why I do. And then no nobody watches. watches. <laughs> <laughs> no, we, we kind of stalled out at 600 subscribers, and that was before we started doing the live show. But uh, also, you can find us on a podcast. Yeah, honestly, the links to all this shit are available on our website. It's openlyhostileopinions.com. I know it's a long fucking word. Yeah, because we're stupid. We didn't know how the internet worked. <laughs> yeah, why don't you use I like, a I, redirect I thought, or something? I thought I said that already. What the fuck is wrong uh, Duffy, as soon as I get a cash out from uh, Patreon, which should be coming soon, I will be sending you your shirt, and you should. I'll send. It, I think I get tracking information, and I'll send it to you over Twitter. Yeah, Trevor, we didn't forget about you, dude. No, the, we uh, got you. We got you coming. It took us forever to send Sai's shirt out. I felt bad for that. Yeah, and then Sai's shirt got fucked up or something. No, she got another one and lost it. Actually, we still owe her a shirt. Oh, really? <laughs> because she ordered one and it never came to her, and yeah. that's why we don't use that supplier anymore. Yeah, if you didn't hear us say that, Trevor. Um, then you probably didn't hear us say thank you. I, I wanted to say thank you for uh, upping your thing to 20 bucks an uh, episode. I really appreciate that's that. A, that's a big deal yeah, for making this happen. Like once Jay texted me, I was like, God, I love Trevor. I want to. Fu- he wants to fuck Greg in the ass? I want to fuck him in the ass. <laughs> yeah, <a> threesome. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. Greg, Gre- the, the, the new 20. It's called a thripple. <laughs> 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 what? <laughs> it's kids talk these days. I don't, I don't know. A thripple. A 22-year-old told me. Her name's Chelsea. <laughs> <laughs> what? 
<laughs> All right, then. <laughs> we're, we're making Greg revamp our setup, though, here pretty soon, so uh, every little bit like that helps. So if any of you want to become patrons and join us on the patron-only show, it's patreon.com slash openly hostile opinions. Uh, even, a, even a buck a, an episode will get you access, and we do some cool shit like... Uh, that jailbird here made a prison stromboli with a fucking extension cord Shit, a couple weeks that, ago. That's right here, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. That extension cord back there was how we cook it. Yeah, when I, I found it on the floor. I'm like, I'm not getting rid of that. I'm putting it up there in the sombrero. Because right. <laughs> yeah. we ain't racist. No. Actually, before we go, I want to play this. Hold on a second. Where is it? Okay, go for it. <laughs> I yeah, just, I just love that. Awesome. Mark Hammer needs to come back on the show. I, know, I don't does. know where the hell we're going to put him now. We have no more room. Yeah, I know. We have to reorient the room eventually. Yeah, I don't know. We'll think of something. <laughs> I still got to get markers so we can write on that thing more. Because it's, it's been the cake is a lie for like months now. <laughs> I can't I that's that Coke. <laughs> <laughs> you thought I said what? Coke. The Coke is a lie. We got to get another, we gotta get another uh, a marker. Yeah, we definitely do. Fuck Craig and Casey. Oh my god. Is 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 Autumn your your lady friend? <laughs> your lady friend. You yeah, see, see you're, I bet you he's not too much of a bitch to call it his girlfriend. Yeah, because it's probably not. Oh. It's probably not. It's not the girlfriend. And actually I can't say that <laughs> word. It's it's so every time I say friend, it's <laughs> <laughs> it makes me sick inside. <laughs> god, you're so broken. I know. I am. I love it. I love this it. This mic stand's broken too. I have to keep holding it. Uh, yeah, it's well, not as bad as the one I threw across the that's room. What, that's what we get when we order stuff from China that probably a three year old made. <laughs> we we put our whole setup together for under two hundred dollars. So yeah. what do you want? <laughs> yes, Jay Autumn is my girl. See, he'll say it. It's oh, not really? that hard. It's just oh, just really? try that girl. You know, you friend. know, you know. He didn't say girlfriend. He just said his girl. So, Tuffy, say girlfriend, so no, he'll shut up. No, it's not his girlfriend. Probably, even if it was, he, my girl's okay. My girl, my girl. <laughs> Talking about my girl. I mean, you can't keep referring to Megan as the girl who lets you uh, stick it in her. Uh, it, I don't know. She doesn't let me touch her, really. She, like, I, I make, Bullshit! I make her sick. <laughs> I, I make her sick. She she just comes home, and she's like, hey, you want to hang out? And I come over, and she vomits immediately. Just all <laughs> over the place. Yeah, because you're slapping the shit out of her. It's not See, my... Autumn is my girlfriend. See, don't be a it's bitch. Not that hard. Oh, whatever. He paid her. <laughs> <laughs> he, he paid her. They've been on Craigslist or Christian Mingle, probably. I don't know. Christian, <laughs> Christian Mingle. Mingle. That's a real one. It's it's called Christian Mingle. You know they have dating sites for people with STDs. Oh yeah, there's there's all sorts of ones. Oh, good. I need that site. What is it? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, the the hiv dot com. I thought you can't get it from sex. The hiv That's Mingle. not the one I'm talking about. Oh, you have AIDS? Probably. Nah. The, get the fuck away from me, you piece of the, shit. The hivmingle.com. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got to get the fuck out of here. I have Greg, to go to work. Greg has to go to work. He has to eat breakfast and shit. I got to go eat breakfast, yeah. take a shower. So uh, thanks again, Trevor, for donating 20 bucks. That really means a lot. Everyone, have fun. Have a beautiful day. We love um, you a long time. Don't later. do drugs. Goodbye. Thanks again to Glenn Griffith for joining us. We appreciate <laughs> it. This has been the Openly Hostile Opinions Podcast. <laughs>